And Jovita Idar was an activist that fought for Mexican Americans during a time of segregation. Decades later, she's set to be the first Tejana to be featured on U.S. currency. Night Team's Camila Juarez tells us why Idar's legacy in San Antonio, in San Antonio, is worth being remembered. It's not every day you get to be related to somebody who's on American currency. Daniel Lopez is a descendant of Ovita Edad. She was born in Laredo in 1885 and spent the second half of her life in San Antonio's West Side. These are stories we grew up with. Uh, we didn't learn about Jovita in school or in articles. We heard about her growing up in our family. Lopez is hoping more people will learn Edad's legacy now that the U.S. Mint and the Smithsonian made her part of the American Women's Quarter Program. Who inspires change? Jovita Idar. Making her the first Tejana featured on U.S. currency. Idar was on the front lines of Mexican She was a journalist, American activist, and suffragist that advocated for the rights of Mexican-Americans. She encouraged women to be involved in public policy. She talked about everything, the lynchings, the discrimination that was going on, the school segregation, um, the just the unfairness of, of the social structure of that time period. Very courageous for the time. In the early 1900s, San Antonio was experiencing a tuberculosis endemic and the city's west side wasn't part of the city's sanitation system, allowing diseases there to spread easier. She worked at the Robert B. Green Hospital, which was the charity hospital on the west side. They had a lot of tuberculosis patients there, so she was a translator, and she also taught classes in sanitation to try to help people stay healthy in those environments. Idad wrote a newsletter about why women should vote and become educated. Her famous quote is, when you educate a woman, you educate a family. This Mexican-American act Lopez now hopes more people will dig into their own family history. Just start asking questions, because you might find a Jovita in that history. There will be a celebration for Jovita Idad here at Market Square tomorrow from noon to 4. There will be musical performances to celebrate her life. Camelia Juarez, Quesa 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.